What's going on everybody? Welcome to another vlog. It is Friday the 2nd and we're going to have a three day weekend with Mr. Jason Spriggs aka Triple Three Spriggs. Make sure to check out his channel. I'll put a link in the description below. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. Consider subscribing if you will. So right now, first day of the three day weekend, we're getting the little pit bike ready. Um, I just took out the pilot jet because it's sputtering on the bottom end. So I'm gonna take this to him right now and we're gonna go to Ken and Joe's. This weekend, uh, Mr. Jason will be racing the MX World Vets um, at Glen Helen Raceway. And it's a uh, two day event. It's gonna be Saturday and Sunday. And we're gonna drive up to his house tonight, crash there. We're gonna drive up uh, to the track in the morning and race Saturday and Sunday. We'll probably sleep there too. So let's stick around. Let's go to Ken and Joe's, get this pilot jet, and we'll see you guys there. All right, we're at Ken and Joe's. Let's go get the part that we need. What's going on, brother? Hey, man, how you doing? What's up, Sam? Hi. Are you filming? Yeah. I need that pilot jet, but maybe a smaller size. Oh, you know what I was about to say? Oh. Whoa. I can't find a number on it. That's the problem, right? That's not the problem. That's going to be hard to find? Like... You ready for the weekend, dog? No, not right. <laughs> Parks too. Okay. Shelly, you're back. Hi, honey. How are you? Good. How are you? Good, babe. Good to see you. Good to see you too. Thank you. It's good to be seen. KTM's bikes. Is this a 450L? Yes, it is. Works edition. Take care, man. Alright, brother. Good day. Another one. Alright, so we're just leaving Ken and Joe's. Unfortunately, they didn't have the pilot jet. It's like a special thing. I, could, I probably only need to get it from um, the pit bike maker, Pitzer Pro because it's a knockoff carburetor, so it's gonna be hard to find. But I didn't need fuel line, got that. So we're gonna go back, put it on, and then we're gonna wait for Jason to come to my house around six or so after he gets off work, and then we'll be on the way to his house. So, see you there.
the pit bike running as good as it's gonna get for now. Like I said earlier, we couldn't, I couldn't find that pilot jet that I needed because it's a knockoff carburetor. But we got it good enough. It's not like we're racing the thing. We're just gonna be riding it around back and forth um, <clears throat> to cheer on Jason at the race. So we're gonna pick this video up later um, at his house. We'll probably see you guys on the way there. He's gonna come to my house around six o'clock, like I said, and we will be on the way to his house. So we'll see you guys there. All right, guys, so Jason just came to my house and we're on his way to his house right now. Got him right behind me, or in front of me, I mean. So we're heading to his house now. We're gonna work on his bike, get it ready for tomorrow. Um, do one more thing on the pit bike, switch out the fuel lines real quick. Uh, I know I did that earlier, but it ended up being too short, so I got another one, a long, little bit longer. So we're gonna do that, and we'll see you guys at his house. The famous garage of the Triple Three Spriggs. The only street legal bike he has, but he has wants nothing to do with it. It's not worth his time. It's not worth his time. I have another one. I know, it's that orange one right there. Like Jamaha. Yeah. But it's a... Uh, I think so. 250, 125, and the famous faux fitty. They all look the same. Yeah, just a little bit. Oh, you put the uh, handguards on. Well, it's late. 11.30. We finished Jason's bike, got the whole shot device on, we did his Hydraulic clutch, got out his broken bolt, and we just loaded up. Now we're gonna go to bed, wake up at 4.30 in the morning, and go to Glen Helen. Gates open at six. Practice starts at seven, right? Seven? Practice starts at seven, gates open at six? So that's the plan. So good night, see you in the morning. It's early. We woke up at 4.30. And it's 5.16 now. Just about to head out to the track. We got loaded up. Got Jason. As ready as he'll be, right? We're gonna stop and get some breakfast on the way. And then we'll go to the track. See you guys there. Well, we're at Glen Helen now. Jason just got done with his practices. How's the track? That's what Pasha said too. <laughs> said it was like, he, like it. he said it was really muddy and the, it's already extremely hammered. <laughs> this is gonna be, it's gonna be an interesting race. I'm looking forward to watching Jason. His bike's already nice and dirty. So I think they're going to start race number one pretty soon. I think he, he is the last race of the day. Race number 15 out of 15. There's two motos. So we're going to be here for a while. Do they switch it up tomorrow or are you going to still be like race number 15 as well? So when we go out there to watch Jason race, we'll get some footage. I'm going to be his pit crew today since I'm not old enough to race this yet. Getting his lap times, making sure his bike's good. Helping him on the start line. Lap times, that all good stuff. So stay tuned. All right, so I just wanted to show you guys this real quick. The conditions and how brutal motocross gets with track deterioration. These braking bumps are massive. They're almost like whoops within themselves. And you got all these ruts and a lot of people are falling down in this corner. That just goes to show how brutal motocross is. Well, we're getting ready to line up with Jason pretty soon. They're lining up 14 and he's raced 15. So we're getting him ready, doing his little hand stretches, got his water, got his air pump, got the whole shot device that we put on last night. Got the bike all good, looking nice. We'll get some footage of him and see how he does. Alright, 
He just took off. Jason just took off on his race. Now we're gonna get some footage of him, cheer him on, help him out any way we can. Let's go, Jay! Look at this track deterioration guys, it's really bad out here. Watch this bike go through. See how rough it is? Look at that. Let's go Jay! Good morning everybody, it's day two 
of the MX World Vets. It's about 10 minutes from the first practice. I just got Jay's bike ready to go, check tire pressure, got his bike warmed up, checked his fork pressure, topped him off with gas. Oh, what a good pit bike guy I am. You ready to go, Jay? Day two? No? You better be ready. He's gonna be ready. He doesn't have a lot of faith in himself, I do. So we'll see you at the track, on the track. already been a crash. Turn one. The guy's hardly moving. So once they, so they just went flag that race. Once they clear it up, they're gonna do this gear drop again. Then after this one, his race is next. So, Jason just finished his second moto, and we'll see how he did later. We're gonna go check that paperwork, but right now, or pretty soon, we're gonna film Brian Balding, aka the owner of N2 Dirt.
Really cool guy. Got 11th in that race, 10th overall out of 24, a little less than mid pack. It's the first time doing it. So we got all loaded up now. Drive to his house, and then after his house, we're gonna drop his stuff off, and then we're gonna drive to my house with me alone. That'll be that. See you guys there. Well, we're home now. We went to Jason's house, dropped him off, dropped his stuff off. Then I came here, unloaded my stuff. This bike's still clean. This bike got super dirty. I was blasting around on the kids' track in between Jason's races because I was a little bored. Hi, Dad. Hi. Jane, welcome back. So yeah. It's good to be back, Dad. <laughs> Yay. Got some good footage of Jason. Yay. Interesting to be his pit crew this weekend. Yay. Got some good footage of Brian, the founder of N2 Dirt Suspension. Yay. If you guys need suspension work, make sure to check him out. I'll leave the info in the description. If you guys like this video, like it. If you guys want to follow along with all my other adventures, subscribe. Don't forget to check out my Instagram, at dsklar41. That'll be in the description as well. And don't forget to tap that bell notification to stay up to date on all my new videos. Have a good weekend, everybody. See you in the next one.